Welcome to Kaichi Live. I'm Kaichi, and this is my trailer reaction. The first official trailer for Toy Story 4 was released. Uh, not sure what to expect. So um, anyway, I got the trailer queued up. Tap it. Got the trailer queued up. Queued up on my dead. Anyway, the, uh, I got the trailer queued up, queued up on my tablet right here. Earphones. Push play now. Everyone, Bonnie made a friend in class. Oh, story. she's already making friends. No, no, she literally made a new friend. I want you to meet Forky. Uh, hi. Hello. Hi. Hi. Ah. <gasps> He's a spork. Yes. Yeah. A spork. Wow, you're making the same as this spork. Is the most Forky. Boy to Bonnie right now. We all have to make sure nothing happens to him. Woody, we have a situation. I am not a toy. I was made for soup, salad, maybe chili, and then the trash. Buzz, we've got to get Forky. Affirmative. Wait, what? That's weird. Why am I alive? You're Bonnie's toy. You are going to help create happy memories that will last for the rest of her life. Huh? What? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Bo? Forky, come on. Bo? Bo? Hi there. My name is Gabby Gabby. We can't stay. <laughs> yes, you can. Boy. Oh. Oh. Bo! What are you doing here? No time to explain. Come with me. We need to get back to our kid. Aw, oh, Sheriff Woody always coming to the rescue. Bonnie needs Forky. Woody, who needs a kid's room when you can have all of this. Wow, her voice changed a little bit. Aren't we going to Bonnie? We have to find them. What do we do, Buzz? What would Woody do? Jump out of a moving vehicle? Let's go! Hey, you gotta go, you gotta go. Okay. Oh, oh, Bonnie's dead! You've handled this lost toy life better than I could. Open your eyes, Woody. There's plenty of kids out there. Sometimes change can be good. You can't teach this old toy new tricks. You'd be surprised. Bonnie? We're going home, Forky. God only knows why I'm coming. Okay. On my way, Woody. Infinity and beyond. Oh, why? Wow. You look different. <laughs> New toys, of course. Don't let Woody leave. Kids lose their toys every day. I was made to help a child. I don't remember it being this hard. Woody? Somebody's whispering in your ear. Everything's gonna be okay. Oops. <sighs> wow, I guess um, was 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 wrong about um like, okay, like, well, I guess most of the I guess most of most like the main problem that most people have is like, um, for some reason people get in their uh, an idea in their heads like the trilogy is supposed to be a perfect thing like. Well, since ever since since of the sequel, you know, Hollywood hadn't got right, and the first movie was perfect at itself. I honestly, I didn't like the second one. I re not as much as people did. Other people did. I thought the second one was feel like more like a TV made movie. Meaning, like it felt like uh, one of those sequels that not a lot of idea was put into it. But it's like. The second one is basically talk about Woody's background, where he comes from, like why some people are after them. And the third one, third one's basically close the book on when close the book on Andy when he grows up. You know, after he grow out, I mean, grew up, and sometimes we don't play without toys anymore as much as we used to, or we sometimes collect them and put them on a shelf or some way display them. Not like like we you used to play when we were kids, but this fourth one like also about the idea of that a, a toy could pass not well not pass down more like instead instead of toy being replaced, the child is being replaced, or maybe vice versa maybe. But this fourth one, uh, like Bo Bo is 
I haven't heard her Bo's voice for a while. Wow. It's, it seems a little bit different. Uh, that's interesting. It seems a little bit different. It's more like ide ideology. Ideals, not a goal with ideology. It's more like ideals of... Bo, Bo is definitely different. She's not as as that bold of damsel in distress. She's more lot more independent, which I like. I mean, of course, Woody loves her, and she, of course, she loves him. But maybe their paths are not exactly online anymore at this moment. And Bonnie, uh, I'm okay. I, I don't know. Maybe I am okay with um. Maybe they open a new chapter in their life with another kid. And the idea with Forky, it, it, they do mention it's a spork. So, uh, so that's a, that's the thing. Technically, a toy is just a more well, a toy made up of um, a plastic material. So, I mean, what's the difference between a, a, a toy maker uh, carving out a toy of uh, a, a block of wood? I mean, a, a block of wood could be a toy too. This is imagination. I mean, there's like a whole big thing, like a big theory about how like what's how toys come alive because maybe the love of, of a child give um life to a toy. I mean, maybe that's how it's working. Because that's because that having more well, ideas sort of in the background. Remember uh, in, in the first Toy Story when when Sid cannibalized those toys and put them together. I mean, are there new toys or are they the same toys? That's that's thing and. I don't know. I mean, this one's interesting. I mean, it's another chance of maybe Woody's been a while, around for a while, so I can mention it was it was this hard for him to um to be there for the kid. We see Bonnie and his mom and dad. Wow, his dad, her dad, her dad, her dad. I mean, her dad. Well, that's the first time seeing her dad. I mean, her mom. I saw her mom around. Well, this is interesting. Uh, of course, it's always fun to have new toys, and maybe it also goes back to the idea of maybe being an adult, you do play with toys, but at the same time, you sort of not play as when you were a kid. You sort of collect them because, like this, it's like that looks like an antique, um, or maybe an auction, auction, um, a store, and there's a carnival there too. So maybe it's like a town, like maybe kids come, kids go. Um, it seems like Bo called, I mean, Rudy called Bo um, a lost toy. Maybe, like I said, she's different now. And, I, I, and I'm glad that she's different. I mean, they've been fought, I mean, uh, we don't know how what happened to her exactly. Uh, we pay, maybe they gave her away or sold her off. <sighs> Wait, when's it coming out? Is it coming up this year? I don't know. Wow. Uh, Buzz sounds a little bit different too, um, and Jesse also. Uh, I know it's a little bit like the like the maybe it's an error or maybe they're still fixing it up or probably not. I don't know. Uh, maybe because sometimes they do trailers. Sometimes do cut like the voices and the scenes differently. It doesn't usually. I know it doesn't match up a bit. But anyway, oh, wow. So yeah, it, 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 it's like taking. It feels like it's taking like the best part of the other three Toy Stories. Like this one, the, the idea of like replacing a child so you would never a toy would never feel lost that way. That's like similar to um the daycare and the third one and the they get they um buzz. I mean, Woody getting lost. It's the same thing as well when when he and Buzz got when we, after he, he um accidentally pushed Buzz out the window and. They got off the, at the, that train station and got on that uh, piece of bus. I mean, the piece of uh, delivery truck. That felt like that, like a road trip. Oh, what else? It, yeah, road trip. And it feels like a different... Like in the story story, too, it's like when they go out to look for Woody. Same. It's not the same thing, but it seems like a little best part. I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing, but I want to see how they play out. Oh, yeah, Bobby is different. I, I like her that way, but I mean, they're so maybe, maybe I don't know. I mean, would they want to make another sequel? 
I mean, let's, let's, let's just focus on this one. Maybe I'm thinking maybe there's a chance that Woody might go with Bo Peep, or maybe not. Let the way the movie's gonna come out to you know what's going to happen or how the Pixar's going to tell that story. Oh, this, but it's uh, definitely one thing. Uh, it's gonna be a good cry. Um, that's the reason why I like, always um, go watch these movies, uh, Pixar movies. It always give me um, get to cry because after a good cry, I appreciate it. Uh, some of the movies I yeah, pick, I had a couple some more times, but most of their Toy Story movie yeah, uh, and uh, other movies uh, it made me cry. And I, after that, I feel a lot better. So I guess I'm looking forward to this movie. Uh, when it comes out, I'll check it out and wait and see after that. So, um, yeah. Disclaimer The first official trailer for Toy Story 4 does not belong to me. All right, was right back to Pixar, Walt Disney, and also their rightful owners. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, hit that like button. Go over here to my previous video and go over here. Subscribe to my channel, Kajila, for future nerd geeky videos. Thank you.